Central Coast Little League team beginning its quest towards a championship. They've been in Williamsport, PA since last week, counting down the hours. Last week, they got some words of encouragement from David Cohn, former Yankee. Today, it was a current Yankees pitcher that's getting behind the team. Kevin Marr joins us now to tell us all about it. And this has been such a cool ride for these kids, Kevin. Unbelievable ride, Joe. I don't know about you, but I wasn't this popular at 12 years old. And I certainly wasn't getting pats on the back like the one the Massapequa boys got today. Joey Leonetti throws a no-hitter. Thanks to the team's run to the Little League World Series, Massapequa has become a baseball hotbed. High fives all over. Over here, here guy. Today, oh, Yankees all-star pitcher Nestor Cortez jumped into it. Oh, I like your mustache. <laughs> better than mine. He came to a Massapequa PAL baseball clinic to make these boys and girls better players. I've been playing baseball since I was four years old, so this brings a lot of memories uh, for me. Today, Cortez was the one creating memories. Some players wanted pictures, others wanted his tips. Leg up. There you go. Nice. With the hopes of becoming just like the Massapequa players in the World Series that even Cortez has enjoyed watching. Congratulations to, to, to them that they threw, they just threw a no-hitter uh, not, not too long ago, um, and hopefully they go all the way. It's a sentiment being echoed all around town, from small signs in pizza shops to the big one at the burger joint. And 200 miles away, in Williamsport, Pennsylvania, the players are finding that support too. People care about where we're from and know like, where our hometown is rooting for us because it's where they used to grow up as a kid. And they're asking, you know, the boys to sign balls or if they have any pins and just, hey, you know, I was, uh, you know, a former New Yorker and I, now I'm living in Tennessee. Congratulations. Go New York. The boys will need all the support they can get because tomorrow will be the next biggest game of their lives. And since Cortez is an all-star and knows all about big games, he had this advice for the team. I would just tell them to have fun, um, enjoy their moment because... 10 years, 15 years on the line, they're going to they're gonna always remember that moment. So I think that's, pre that's special for them. Those hugs never get old. Cortez, of course, has yet to win the big World Series, but there is another guy on Long Island who has won the big World Series, and you'll hear from him and his advice for the boys later in sports. And, Joe, if you like donuts, once bitten donuts in Massapequa tomorrow morning, special donuts in honor of those Massapequa players. Uh, you had me at donuts, but special donuts <laughs> sounds special amazing. Donuts. Great, great visit. We're going to be there live tomorrow morning, by the way, Kevin. But uh, great visit by Nestor there. And these kids, like you said the whole time, they've been handling the pressure so well. Uh, and you talk to them, and they're not 12-year-old boys when you talk to them. They sound like 18, 20-year-old guys. <laughs> they are just calm, cool, and collected. God, love it. Love it. All right. Big win tomorrow night. Let's hope for, the, hope for that.